Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So a couple of months ago, I did a chocolate mousse video, um, but that was just a regular chocolate mousse. Today, I'm going to be making a three ingredient vegan chocolate mousse, and it's going to be absolutely delicious. I'm going to show you the brands of um, what I use that is vegan so it makes it a little easier for you guys to find even if that means you have to buy it on Amazon and all the description all the description <laughs> all the ingredients will be in the description down below uh, so yeah let's get to this video okay guys so uh, the first thing I want to do is show you what I got um, to make this vegan chocolate mousse. So I'm using double cream and um, chocolate in my recipe. And the double cream I have is a plant-based one. As you can see here, it's from Elmley. Elmley is the best double cream brand, in my opinion, that I've ever used. Um, it's really good. And I use it like even for my normal double cream and single cream. Uh, yeah, so they've come out with a plant-based version. I found mine at Asda. I think it's also available at Sainsbury's. Obviously, I live in the UK, so these are the shops that it was available in for me. But if you live in a different country, your shops may even be called different things. Um, so, you know, uh, you can always try and order it off Amazon. Um, I don't know if they do it, but maybe. And this chocolate is my favorite chocolate brand. It's from Dr. Otka. And this one is extra dark chocolate, you guys. I love dark chocolate so much. It's my favorite chocolate. Um, so yeah, it has 72% cocoa solids. It's the type of chocolate I use for literally every single baking, same brand. And it is suitable for vegans, it says here at the back. Um, and I have some coconut oil here, which is vegan. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to show you this recipe. It's super easy and let's get to it. The first thing I'm going to do is add my double cream to my bowl. I'm just gonna give it a little scrape and I'm going to beat it for five minutes until it reaches stiff peaks. For this bain marie, the first thing I'm going to do is fill up a medium saucepan just under halfway uh, full. And I'm going to put that on a heat five and pour in my coconut oil and my chocolate. Now I'm going to stir it until it melts. Um, and this is just a more gentle way of like melting your chocolate and the taste is a lot better as well. Uh, now I'm gonna come back and I'm going to pour my chocolate into my double cream and I'm going to beat it once again and voila, we're ready to put it into the little pots. Okay guys, let's try this out. Mm. Wow, it's so creamy. Mm. Guys, this is absolutely amazing. If you get a chance to um, try out this recipe, please do it. It's literally three ingredients. It didn't take me long at all to whip up. The only thing that takes a while is letting it set. But wow, was that worth it? Yes, it was. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe down below for more videos. Bye.